I love horses. I've always loved horses. I suppose I will always love horses in the future. Even as a kid, uh, I didn't have any money, but I would save up um, whatever money I could, and I'd go buy a horse magazine or uh, maybe even a horse calendar at the end of the year so that next year I could look at horses. Love horses. Always will love horses. And some people out there just love horses a whole lot more, if you know what I mean. I'm speaking, of course, about the good old governor wannabe of the state of New York, a Republican, and I'm going to uh, get this right to read my notes so I don't want to um, get this wrong. Carl Palladino. That's Palladino, not me, <laughs> Palomino. Paladino. He loves horses too, by golly. And it's gotten him into considerable um, trouble among the more saner, that is, non tea partier lunatics out there. Speaking about uh, emails wherein he sent or received or both images of a horse having sex with a human being. The title of the email, of course, was, and I'll, I'm going to title this video, the same title that e the email has, Easy! Steady, big fella! XXXX. Who says Republicans can't be clever and funny and humorous deliberately? Quoting uh, I guess I could paraphrase. I'm going to put a link to uh, one of the many articles on the subject down here, down there. YouTube used to have it up there, damn them. They've moved it. Um, he accuses Democrats of wanting to ignore the substantive issues and change the debate from, you know, issues people care about to, quote, having sex with horses, unquote. So he's accusing Democrats of not approving of having sex with horses. Uh, human Democrats, not horse Democrats. Not even uh, jackass Democrats of having sex with horses. As if it's not a problem for the Republicans out there to have uh, humans and horses, you know, trying to copulate. Which, come to think of it, how is that even possible? Anyhow, uh, I don't even want to know. I don't care. Don't send me emails uh, showing how it's possible. Please don't even describe how it might be possible. I don't want to hear it. I'm not a Republican. Never will be. Never have been. I want to quote a uh, two sentences from good old Carl Palladino. And I'm going to read it verbatim because I want to get it correct. To any of the ladies I've offended, I apologize. I say this to the men out there who have never opened a graphic image on the internet. Don't vote for me. Yeah, so if you don't approve of a horse trying to fornicate with a human being, man or woman, boy or girl, don't vote for Carl Palladino. But if you do approve, he wants your vote. Hello.